and he's got good people around him. And, you know, that was a team effort on offense. I mean, the O-line, again, Ray Davis, who continues to be a guy that um, is a bell cow, runs for hard yards, made plays on the perimeter. Um, you know, the, the fourth down conversion for a touchdown is, is not just a great effort by AJ, but again, Ray stays in the fight. He stays in the play and makes an incredible catch there in the end zone. Um, and so a lot of credit to him. I thought, you know, Will Shepard and McGowan both um, facilitated AJ's performance. And that's what it should look like, right? The quarterback is unlocking performance in the other 10 positions on the field. And AJ did that. Uh, and, um, and then those other guys stepped up and did their part too. And it's what you want to see. Um, I saw a complete game, you know, he went out there and he's been doing an all practice long, just taking what he can get and playing his football, you know, we've, uh, he was just playing to our identity, I think, Vanderbilt football identity, just not doing too much, just making the play that's available and came out of the win with that. Um, you know, take us through your, your two touchdowns in the third quarter. Oh uh, man, you know, we had, um. <laughs> uh, we just made the play. That's why I'd say we just made the play. Coach Lynch called the play. AJ put it where it needed to be and took what we can get. What does winning a game in this matter say about maybe the growth of this program, being down 14 and having this comeback like that? Um, and, and you saw we were down 14, and I think what everybody saw is that we just never give up. You know, the defense went out there, and they gave up that first touchdown, but in the second half but after that, they shut them down completely, and then uh, they had a bunch of fourth down stops, third down stops. And I think we just played Vanderbilt football in that second half. That you were starting, and, and what was your reaction? Uh, we have like an earn it every day uh, kind of thing, one of our five covenants. So uh, it was really just be prepared every single week to be the starter or be the backup. And me and Mike are supportive of each other throughout the entire week, just helping each other. Um, you know, what, what did you kind of, um, I guess just what, how did it feel to get your first start and get your first win? Uh, I mean, it felt very good, especially on the road. Um, I'm still not very satisfied. I mean, I think we still have a lot of work to do offensively and as a team. But to get a road win, and especially my first start, it felt very good. Um, you uh, fourth down to, to Ray, uh, almost got sacked on that play. Kind of take me back to that and what, what happened there. Uh, just kind of improvising, like not every play works out exactly how you want it to. Uh, maybe I missed three, I have to watch the film. If I did, and then just improvising off of that. But they uh, blitzed up the middle. I tried to get out of the pocket. The DN came off. He got a hold of me. I just worked my way out of the sack and kept the play alive and just playing through the whistle. Coach just said sometimes things can snowball. And he was talking about negatively, but you guys snowballed them with that 21 point blitz. I mean, what, what did you guys feel? Could you feel that momentum building and shifting as it was happening? Yeah, I think you can feel that in the stands too and on the field. The sideline doesn't change. Uh, I mean, one big play can change the entire momentum of the entire game. So that's what we can't rely on that. Like they had a, I think their first touchdown was a, they got out of the pocket, made a big play, and you kind of felt the stands explode for them. They got a little momentum off of that. Well, we just fired back and the momentum shifted back to us.